that scene right there. Like, That's some heavy okay. shit, man. Yeah. But I also, I feel like, oh, you mean, what? You were mean, you going to start it or no? Yeah. You oh, mean, you want to do one of them a song? Wait, you guys have a skit where you do that? Yeah, well, it's a whole music, we did a whole music video, like Cheech and Chong. Oh, oh, which one was Cheech, Cheech? Which one? Are you recording this? Yeah. I was I was Chong. You were Chong? Yeah, yeah, yeah was I was Chong. Chong yeah. I was Cheech. Um, you were Cheech. Mm-hmm. Yeah, it's pretty pretty dope. And then in the middle yeah. of the song, we cut and we do that skit, like, we left it in the video. Yeah, driving Final okay. video. Yeah, it's in there, yeah. Hey, man. Yeah. You I mean we're smoking? Park, you mean you were smoking dog yeah. shit, man? Well, not, not, we didn't do that whole the whole bit, but man, I wonder that's what some of the dopest <laughs> dope I've ever smoked. I never smoked no yeah. dope like that I in my w- life. I wonder yeah. what Great Dane tastes like. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, classic. Yeah, classic. Dude, that might be one of the best bits of all time. Yeah, it's fucking great. It's so fucking you guys are great. saying Sorry. that you're saying things ramping up in the last month or so. And to yeah. me, it seems like yeah. uh, I would I would have to say mm, maybe in the last 45 days. Yeah. I've seen like a lot of heat come out, at least on a social yeah, you know, on yeah, a social sure. platform, I've been watching you guys like drop new shit like almost every day. It seems like I'm seeing yeah. new, but this shit's dope. Yeah, right. for sure. Um, man. So, I mean that it's got to coincide, right? The, yeah, the, it, it's. I think the second uh, we've been shooting shit at the wall for like almost this whole year, but nothing was sticking. So when it don't stick, you kind of slow down to rethink stuff, and then. Um, we finally just said, fuck it, keep shooting. If it fails, who cares? Next, 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 Think next. less, do yeah. more. Yeah. And fucking, yeah, man. bro. And then it just starts snowballing. Yeah. And um, just probably, just staying consistent because we, we seen the more that we do, the more everything just kind of starts trickling off yeah. to everything else. So that's what we've been doing, man, just yeah. keeping our foot on the gas and just saying, fuck it. Like, if yeah. it don't work, move on. If it works, cool. We got and, tomorrow. If today yeah, didn't work, man. fuck it. There's still tomorrow. Like, in this day and age, it feels like nobody really sits with anything for too long, so mm-hmm. it don't even fucking matter. Yeah. Like, if it don't work and nobody likes it, who gives a fuck? Tomorrow you got another shot. Yeah. Boom. Yeah, Post yeah. It. Fresh start over. And sometimes you get frustrated when you think something's going to work and it don't, and then the shit you don't think is going to work just fucking goes crazy, and you're like, oh, shit. Like, what the fuck? Yeah, have you re- yeah. Re- re-fucking think your whole game exactly. plan? Exactly. Yeah, so it's, it's really no, like, structure or blueprint how to fucking do it. Just yeah. fucking do it. Like, just consistency much. is the only blueprint, I would say. So when people ask, like, because the randomest thing went viral, and I remember even one of the homies called us talking shit because I wasn't dressed. Like, I was just, I was literally he in basketball shorts. rolled out of bed shorts. and flip-flops and shit. One of my What's wrong with flip-flops? Scrum. He had piss <laughs> stains on with, his Lakers shorts. What's wrong with that? Fucking nut stains I like everywhere. piss stains. And I was just That's with, how hey, I grew Jesus up. Jesus and I was just with my son, and I just set the phone up like this. I just laid the verse, and I was like, fuck it, I'm going to just get this verse right here. Not No thought at all. Dude. And I just uploaded it, and yeah. it went crazy. And then we noticed people like that format. Of the phone still for us at least, mm-hmm. and just yeah. zoom in slowly. So we're like, all right, let's try this. Don't format. give him too much game. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> little, yeah. Little, little Wait, I'm bad. writing this down. What <laughs> do I do? You guys, it's cool. All the other rappers, other rappers hey. already been hitting us yeah, up. Yeah, like, yeah. yo, can you help me do this? It's like, bro, for just because it worked for us, don't mean it's gonna work for you. Right. Either. That's yeah. true. Um, so that's why I tell them too, like, bro, don't think that I we got it figured out because we don't. We just shoot a lot. Hey, yeah. how long? But get to the point of that. Like, oh, you did that, and then that song went crazy. Yeah. The shit fucking hit like. 2.3. 2.3 million within like four days or something. And um, yeah, after that, we just were like, oh shit, it's working. Keep kept, going. kept going and fucking shit starting to move after that. Like yeah. we fucking got about what? 11,000 followers within the last three weeks. Yeah. yeah. We gained 11,000, yeah. Right. Fast. Gained, and we're still yeah. gaining every every day, it seems oh, like. That's some heavy um, shit. So it's just like, <laughs> <laughs> the hey. more we do, you know, if we're not doing shit, you guys don't want to talk to us. If we're Are not you doing kidding shit, me? I don't wow. give a I'm shit. Saying you guys. I talk to you I'm any not saying day, you guys, right? I, mean, perce- Anybody- I, I don't mean just you guys. I no. mean in general. Nah, like he keep said, it real. Y'all ain't going to be fucking with us. No, no, no. I'm going to keep it real. Everybody. Any motherfucker that does even an impression us. of Cheech and Chong, <laughs> it's fucking Good all right. Even let's, come in. Even let's say you guys, right? <laughs> Anybody in. wear a hat that says assholes live forever like that, yeah. you come in here, man. Right. I, I right. love that But shit. let's say if you guys, right, on the flip side, let's say you guys like, did the podcast twice a year mm-hmm. and you want us to come <laughs> talk with you guys. It's like, 
Why would we want to come talk to y'all? Not only that, you guys got other shit. Lucky, he's, he's well, Lucky, there. he's a business. He's, yeah, I'm he's a, a fucking grinder, crazy guy. Really. Yeah, I'm a in here. I so, live in a so that's what I'm saying. Thing. Like when you grind, other grinders start to reach out, and then shit starts to move. When you're just sitting on your ass, but you don't go on grinder. Thinking, hmm? nah, nah. <laughs> overthinking. Shit. Wait, Sean, yeah. nothing happens yeah. when you're overthinking. That's hey, right. uh, yeah. hey, Sean, should we do the intro? Like, let's just do the intro in the middle of the show. Like, let's just do this. Yeah, like, fucking stuff. Young yeah. got all happy right now. Exactly this. Happy right now. Yeah. All late. Yeah, that's right. There is no right time. There's no blueprint. There's no. Just do shit. Do shit. Stop yeah. thinking. Stop thinking too much. Exactly. That part. Thank you. Good morning, welcome to the Hard Luck Show. I'm your certified host, Steve Lucky Luciano. Sitting across from me is the Indian, my red brother. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Hey, don't be fucking around. Don't is that racist? Or it, is, it is. Racist. <laughs> I never bro, met an Indian man. that did that. Don't worry, I ain't trying to. Made it. We're native <laughs> too, though. I, I, that don't mean shit to me. Uh, Listen, don't be doing that. Mexicans are native. Yeah, shit, that shit that works Fox for you, it might not work. Hey, that's my Aztec <laughs> owl then. <laughs> no. For my Aztec. No, you do it without the hand. No, no, no. <laughs> oh, there you go. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Okay, go ahead. You didn't even do yours. I don't need to now. It's yeah. already enough. Okay. <laughs> yeah. 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 a professional engineer for the hard luck show. Yes, sir. Yeah. And we've got King Salmon and Big Pick Mike. Big Pick Mike. Covering some visuals. Big Foot. Because there's some visuals Big foot in Mike. here tonight. <laughs> yeah, right? man. Big Foot Mike. Speak on it. We got mm. uh, we got a couple brothers, part of the uh, hard luck family coming down. Most definitely. From... The Hawthorne area. Hey, oh, it oh, is. Oh. Yeah. Oh, Toyota for hire. Yes, sir. Yeah. 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 Good. Yeah. Good. Yeah. Good. Yeah. Show, guys. Good to be back. Good to be back. To be yeah, back. man. So, hey, so shit. at what point, like, let's just stop fucking around. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> at what point do you go from Coyote for hire and you just start telling people, yeah, CFH? Like, when do you do the acronym move? Well, we're just mm. Coyote. Now. Coyote. Yeah. Coyote. Yeah. Coyote. 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 The Yodis. 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 Coyote for hire is just a handle. You know what what about Coyote Peyote? <laughs> what about, no? Peyote? No, no. I haven't Peyote? done it yet. One day. Yeah. One day. You done the ayahuasca? Shit, no, one I'm day. I'm down. I know you you're down. <laughs> you're fucking corduroy green hat. I know <laughs> you're ready. <laughs> Hell yeah. You've done it or not? Who, me? Yeah. Well, you're all, sober now, right? Yeah, no. Dude, I got sober before ayahuasca. And I'll tell you, man. There's probably not a day that doesn't go by. I'm like, man, you're a fucking red brother. Mm -hmm. Red path, man. That's what they call it? No, I'm just, I start talking to myself about Indian shit to uh, see. And then you I'm call like, yourself the red brother. Yeah, oh yeah. Uh -huh. I'm like, yeah. Yeah, I don't tell you. I, red skin doesn't bother None of that shit bothers me. Just give uh -huh. me the fucking money. Shut the fuck up. <laughs> you don't have to be nice to me. Yeah. Just give me back the fucking money and give I'll me. You. Uh, How, have they gave it to you yet? Um, no, no. That's the funny thing about these people. <laughs> they get the money and then they just keep it. They talk I'll about, it, man. yeah, it's, you're there. Yeah. But, uh, <clears throat> but in all, in, in, in all fairness, uh, yeah, I do. I, talk, I I start talking to myself about like, yeah, maybe I should do the ayahuasca. It's a heritage yeah. thing, you know. Yeah. It's like yeah, man. pride. I'm gonna do it one day. I just don't know when. I bought DMT just in case. He bought yeah. DMT. That's just sat in his and pocket for like fucking <laughs> like, forever. That was like six months, <laughs> and then one of the homies was like, "Yo, Fuji's, he's looking for DMT. DMT. If y'all do it, he'll give y'all verse. If you give it to him." And I was like, "What shit?" You can have this shit, and we never got the fucking verse, <laughs> bitch ass fool. We just got uh, high. Uh, I don't even know if he the DMT even got to him. I don't even know if it what was happened cap. to it. I don't know. I gave it to the homie that was gonna give it to his homie, and I just never heard about GZ again. Well, <laughs> yeah. sometimes it goes like that. Yeah, you, you know, know, chunk it up, part of the game. Yeah, that's it. Yeah. You know. So, so, so bring bring us up to speed. My brothers, like, so what's going on for you, right? Like, really, what are you guys working on? We right just now? dropped the project today. Thicker than water. Yeah. Well, it kind of got butchered because the feature didn't get cleared last minute. So all those platforms didn't upload it on time. So I had to delete it all and re upload it and leave that feature ghost. Like, it's in there, but we don't credit him. Now it's a surprise. Yeah, it's feature. a surprise feature in there. But Do as a result, Spotify is not on Spotify yet, but it's on Apple. Spotify is going to come out on Monday. But it's how, called Thicker Than Water. And yes, uh, how do you find out, like, who the, the Duke, is it, is it like an Easter egg? You'll know. Like, how will you, yeah. you'll know. You'll know, for sure. Yeah. Is it a recognizable? 
Very, Big yeah. time. Yeah. Get the fuck out. Yeah, of you know, I mean, if you know hip hop, you know who this guy is. Unless you don't know nothing about rap, then maybe. But you well, strike me as the kind that does. I mm. mean, yeah. Is it like you know, golden? You don't know. You don't know. Is it golden era level? Yeah, yeah. Mm, A little yeah, after. Uh, You're getting warmer. It, the like, end of it. Yeah. <sighs> I say like oh five. Are you yeah. sure this mm-hmm. isn't some mm-hmm. like crafty PR move by <laughs> the Yotes? Nah, this it? isn't. Trust me, it would have been much better to have his name right there. For sure, it would have been way way more credible. Does Even it, though we do tend to do that. Does yeah. his last name <laughs> rhyme with lube and his first name rhyme with nice? Nice lube. No, <laughs> he's stupid, dude. He's stupid. I'll, I'll give you this. I'll give you this. I'll give you this hint. He's named after a, a famous cult leader. Oh, oh, David boy. Koresh. No. <laughs> There's only one rapper named after a famous cult leader. I uh, will leave it at that. Let these motherfuckers figure it out. Yeah. Right. So yeah, oh, I love that. Listen to it. It's called LAS to Jeff K. That's the song on there. So he's from New York. That's another clue. Um, <laughs> But yeah, so that's the Easter egg in there. Besides that, we got homies on there: Simba, the homie Doe Man from Texas, Emilio Rojas from New York, mm. Bino Rido from LA, and the homie Swifty Blue and Cypress Moreno from LA. Well, you know, gentlemen, what you just laid out in a very matter-of-fact way uh, made old Blue Eyes come alight. He knows what I'm talking about. He rarely emotes. No, you said Simba, and I, dude, he he's killing it lately. Oh yeah, dude, we, yeah. we 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 got a banger. Banger, oh. we just dropped a video today too. Yeah, I just saw it's the a video. fucking yeah, yeah. beautiful art piece. Yeah. Um one of the best videos I've seen this year come out. For sure. If you ask me. It's not the best video. Yeah, it's fire. Over here. We just dropped that today. Go check that out. What pisses mm. me off about LA sometimes is they don't appreciate <clears throat> that. Mm. At, at the level that we're at, where it's like up and coming. Sometimes they don't appreciate like art. Like they want like cookie cutter LA shit so it's like I'm looking at this video like this is like video of the year potential type shit and it like goes like under noticed in LA that shit bothers the fuck out of me but it's it's more personal stuff we knew that type of stuff is like risky Art, artistic stuff is risky in LA but at the end of the day that's gonna set boy, us apart from everybody you, in LA boy you ain't lying yeah. when, I, when I hear them them say stuff like that I right away think about uh you know the late like like 90 91 92 of uh me and Esteban and Cartoon building yeah. building our brands you know and trying to get our thing out and like people not wanting to have any kind of art show with yeah. with yeah. either one of these dudes hell mm-hmm. no like you couldn't even get the meeting with the galleries yeah, especially oh, at that time. And then if you did, there was, you know, you'd have some people to tell you, oh, yeah, yeah. And then and then the more they look into it, they'd be like, nah, nah, nah. Yeah. You know, like right. had to leave. Not, and this wasn't even only in L.A. It was the worst in L.A. Where we come from. Right. Yeah. The worst. They were even a little bit more apt to open up and talk to you in New York. Right. You know, than L.A. Right. For sure. But they still weren't doing nothing. Well, we had to go all the way to Japan, bro. And then it came through Europe. Yeah. Then. And this is, this is our, you know, seven, eight years after the fact, bro, that we're doing all this shit with other motherfuckers that get it. You know what I'm saying? Mm-hmm. So when I hear that, it's just like that sometimes. And it's like that. I believe it's like that for, for creative people. Right. Yeah. Right. I think that's like a lot of cr- really creative people are ahead. They end up ahead, you know. Exactly. Uh, you know, it's because uh, you're kind of paving your own lane, yeah. Instead yeah. of following one that's already been made, so you're kind of the one with the, the stick and the yeah. fucking shovel, like. Yep. You know I mean? And I really think that. I want to say. I, I want to say this to you guys. I want to say that that the feelings attributed to that, and when <clears> I'm looking at that could maybe make me guess second guess or guess or really start to overthink like you guys mm-hmm. were talking about yeah but it would never ever have me quit because nah. i'm too invest I, I see i have almost a tunnel vision to like that's what i'm that that's whether i'm making it or not making it at the end of the day this yeah. is what i do that's it i don't yeah. know none you know what i'm saying so yeah. 
And and somehow I might go way out here, but as soon as I put my thinking cap and get my head together, I'm right back on it because mm. I realize like I'm into this thing. And I think that I try and explain that to people is like if you're really about it, then you're gonna you're gonna roll with it. Then yeah. either you see this shit or you don't see it. Like yeah. that's all that's all I can ask you. Is sometimes I 100%. think like it's not even worth explaining to people. Like sometimes yeah. you're well, right. But like I'm like, how can I explain this to a child or fuck? You can't really. But if you, you can show see them. it, if you can actually, if you believe, let me just say it like this: if you actually believe it, then how can anything make you unbelieve something that you believe? No, right. I agree with that. And but then, but I'm saying like explain to somebody else. I, I not, dude, you know how many explanations I've given in my goddamn life? They only they only see the vision when you show it to them by results. Like mm. even now, yeah. right that we're getting a little motion. Now the conversation about the Yodis has shifted just a little. Right. Because now it's like, oh, shit. Like, they're getting numbers now? Like, and we're just doing it oh, completely by ourselves. Oh, I always knew you guys ourselves. were. Yeah, I always knew you guys were yeah, on something. We knew, yeah, I know, we, know, <laughs> we know the people that, that really have, though. Like, right. like, we know. That's why I tapped in with Lucky. Like, this is our first interview since the, the project dropped. Because I want to tap in with people that really fuck with us. Right. Like, yeah. all that other shit is like, all right, I'm, take, I'm taking mental notes of... There's big DJs with big platforms that they've told their homies, oh, they heard about us, but for some reason they're scared to bring us on there or because who we've been attached to in the past, uh, not knowing that we're really out here doing this shit independently. Like, So people are so afraid just based on with the little they know because we don't go on social media to bash people that have tried to help us. Mm -hmm. um, and they just, they, it's like, isn't it obvious that we're doing it by ourselves? Like, to still... Uh, attach us to, to something that has zero to do with what we're doing mm. and, and to be afraid to fuck with us is a I bet like my whole mentality is like if if the city like the big people don't don't fuck don't champion us like before we get to where we're gonna get I'm gonna pop my shit every chance I get about them like I don't like how they did Tyler the Creator like LA that's how they did Tyler bro like mm. then nobody fuck with Tyler until the whole world fuck with Tyler now LA's like oh shit he's selling out the Staples Center oh shit like it's like, bro, that shit's lame. And I think the media in L.A. does that a lot. Well, I'll That's tell you right. something. Big Lux, though, I mean, that guy's a visionary. Oh, yeah, I know. Sure. Lux. Big For Lux sure. sees shit. He sees trends. He understands things. And, 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 and so that's why he brings, he brings people in. I got to say this, though. It's a different media landscape, too. You yeah. know what I mean? It's like there was a time when you dropped a video I mean, that was part of the programming on MTV. They were running yeah. out of shit. They needed yeah. to put shit up there, yeah. right? Now you drop a video and you've got, like, everybody's dropping. It's like making a T-shirt now. It's right. like, I mean, everybody's yeah. making it. It's right. like, so yeah. how do you fucking, how do you, how do you set yourself apart? Like, how do you go, like, fuck that. All right, fine. But I was telling him that the other day, too. Well, I was like, I don't even think music videos even fucking matter anymore. Like, we're spending all this money and coming up with all these crazy ideas, wasting all this time to put out a video that people don't even really give a fuck about anymore. They're just like, oh, oh on to the next, you know what I mean? Right. Instead of just pulling out your phone, recording a freestyle, and filming it, boom, putting it up, does way more numbers than a fucking Every time. video. And Every way time. cheaper. And it's free. Yeah. Way cheaper. It's, it's free. free. It's more effective because people are just scrolling on their phones, up, 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 down, up, down, you know what I mean? And move on to the next. So that's it, just like you were saying, like when I was telling him, like, this shit don't even matter no more. The overproduced like, videos, like, we like to do them because our artistry, but in reality people don't give a fuck bro. yeah i mean when was the last time until they do right. until, until they, they do, do. Until because they do. Until they do. i see yeah. those videos and i fucking dig you guys yeah. videos. it sets us apart say. though you can say what's absolutely bro that the creativity dope even, shit and even yeah. with our phone videos yeah there's creativeness but you want right. to know something yeah, i want to know something yeah. when everybody finds out then you'll one day go look at their videos and they'll be out of control. Yeah. Everybody sees yeah, it because they, they you know. So but I know, I know, I. You guys filmed a video, and it was like there's a car. It's on the street. I want to say it might be a van. It was getting broken. The one I was getting broken. Yeah, I think oh, yeah, so. Yeah, yeah. I think it was one of the first videos I seen you guys. But since that day, as soon as I saw you guys, I was like, the whole look. The more I asked questions, found out more about you guys, I was like. 
These dudes are dope. These dudes are going to blow the fuck up. I don't know how they're not already blowing up. It's none of my business. Right. I, but I, I know I it's coming. I, know I, I know it's coming. It's inevitable. <laughs> so, There's exactly. nobody it's like you guys doing what you're doing. Right. Um, yeah. you're, real, you're really, really doing it, too. You guys really are doing exactly what, what's up, what we're seeing. And I just know you guys are going to do well. I fuck with you because I'm excited. Every yeah. time I see some yeah, stuff by sure. you guys, man, I'm like, I feel like you guys are also in many, many ways, representing, I feel like you guys are representing fucking L.A. to an extent, you know? Sure. I really feel that. And you guys are representing it in a manner that's not how this city's represented in the, the main, primarily. Somebody's willing to not be that guy. Ah, there's a little hints, this and there, but that's part of our culture, the streets of L.A., but that's not you the guys only layer. Right. right. You guys aren't having to like to have enough balls to be like, you know what? Or courage. I don't have to be that motherfucker. That's not who I am. I don't need to be that. I'm like, this yeah. is, let me, you know, uh, and I ain't a punk either, but like, this is, here's who I am. And, and creating yeah. in these different visual manners and musical manners and flow and case to, and your, and your look, you guys just look to be able to feel like, you know what, man, I'm just about this. I find it brave. I think that it's brave. And I For also sure. think that um, these are like true creators. These guys are probably seeing some stuff that some other people, they ain't seen it yet. They're not yeah. seeing it yet, well, but it's coming. Well, yeah. but I mean, don't you guys think we live in a time that's probably the most conformist and fucking it's ever been in the entire history what of America? Like, it just seems like. Monkey it, see, monkey do? Or what? Yeah, like it's conformist. Like it's kind of boring. I yeah. get bored a lot. I'm like, ah, I yeah. mean, I've seen Same this motherfucking shit. Yeah, yeah, like yeah, I'm yeah, tired yeah. of it. Absolutely. I don't want to see I, even movies. Like I'm like, all right, and then what happens? At the end, they learn something new and they go yeah. off to do a fucking skip dance. Yeah, I'm sick right. of that shit. Like I yeah. want to see some real shit. Yeah. yeah, you want to see like the sure. star get blown away fucking 10 minutes before the movie's over. Same or, here, man. Yeah, yeah. Or, or like, you know. He this... wants to see the introduction in the middle of the podcast. Yeah. Right. <laughs> I want to see like a. Re- re- that's why to I. To live get... and die in LA. Even as a rapper, like, I get tired of. Even though we're great at whatever rap, rap, what people want to say. Yeah. I get tired of doing that sometimes too. So, like, even on the album, if y'all hear it or the mixtape, you're going to hear some songs where we're kind of singing on it or. We got a, you know what I'm saying? Like a Good. song about our kids where it's melody based. Good. Yeah, because I'm not going to, even though you know it's for this, it's like, even when it comes to that, like, I'm not, I'm not going to be allowed to be boxed in any way. Like, yeah, we, we're dope as fuck with the bars. Like, probably better than 99.999% of everybody. But, yeah. Yeah. But like, we could do this too, though. Check out this melody. Yeah. And I you feel know? like a great fucking, I mean, listen, when you, you, you can pull up any greats, yeah. any greats you want. And you listen to them, and they have a range. Right. Exactly. You know, you would, you would have, you know, I don't know. I'm trying to make an example, but you, uh, you'd have a fucking rock group that would do a blues whole thing. Right. Or a reggae type. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Like, you know, 10 like, CC. And, and they'd, sh- they'd show. I mean, fucking Sinatra would show off how he would sing in d- at different cadences with different types. Well, you that's know what I'm ma- that's mastering the crap. Right. And showing that, and not. But see, man, I feel like in this day and age, and kind of like what you're talking about right now, it's like motherfuckers are scared. For sure. To, exp- like, they got this thing wrapped up in a way where it's like, it's the opposite of what this is about. This is about expressing yourself. Yeah. And that's what art is. Yeah, I think that's you, part you, of I, I don't mean, know if you can be a tough guy and really express yourself yeah, at the same yeah, time. Yeah, all the time. It's like, you can't be tough all the time. Yeah, like, man. Like, Even like, tough guys tough. ain't tough all the time. Exactly, they take a bubble bath. They fucking yeah, take themselves out sure. on a personal date. I'm telling sure. you, you guys, man, whole energy and your shit is the, it's what's, ha- it's what's coming, dude. You for guys sure. are right yeah. on time, dude. Yeah, yeah. I, I really believe that mm. whatever you guys are seeing like because i look at you guys and i'm like oh it's just rolling it's, yeah, ro- it's, it's rolling. rolling it's gathering it's as it's rolling this right. thing is getting me. that's how i see you guys right. there's yeah. there's no way it can't be yeah. who else is there it's you guys the only way is if we stop right that's the only yeah. way so and we, us. and we notice when we even take a week off it's like Everything slows down. It's like that's the t- climate we live in. Like yeah. you gotta be. Yeah. 
it's, constantly it's, it's, hitting it's it stressful. up. Man. It's how many stressful. Big, how many big motherfucking job. musicians or bands or groups fucking had to fucking beat the shit up before anybody figured it <laughs> exactly. out? I mean, look at David Bowie, bro. David yeah. Bowie? David Bowie's that guy I use all Listen, the time. That's a me... motherfucker that was unafraid to do his shit no right? matter what. Unafraid? Yeah. And everybody was yeah. sucking his dick, holding open doors open for him. Let me tell you something. Yeah. This motherfucker, David Bowie... He had a whole folk career before he became David exactly. Bowie. Exactly. That's Walking dope. around with a That's fucking crazy. guitar and fucking playing and fucking see, living on you, nothing. You, you days can't be scared days. to reinvent yourself. Like yeah. reinvent, yeah. If, I, I, reinvent yourself every you three years. You gotta constantly reinvent yourself. Yeah. Yeah. I think that's a key. And when people say that, you know what? Somebody I think about uh. that reinvented themselves. Yeah. Uh, I think that was part of the success of Madonna, not her recreation now, but <laughs> oh, as she Madonna reinvented was herself through, right now. She career, looked real crazy. She was really reinventing herself and her music and her look. Yeah. Like maybe back then it wasn't every three years. I think it was you know maybe every ten. But yeah. she was definitely. I remember saying, "Man, she'd come like out on some other shit, but that would be the shit that was cracking." Like she'd be yeah. right on time with it, you know what I'm saying? I always feel Michael like Jackson, other thing. a lot of people. Yeah, yeah but I always wonder if like people like that, Jay. who Jay Z, Kanye West. Yeah, I always wonder yep. if people like that though got like a like a team that's like got their ear to the nah, ground. Yeah, either. come on, on, Madonna. You're, well, I think you're Madonna on, had like a wrong. fucking team of people who are like, girl, it is gonna be about Vogan. You need to mm. fucking move your but body. But either and she like, was gonna listen to that or not. I they, mean, I don't know. I but. think more oftentimes the team don't know shit. You know where these people get it from? <laughs> it's from people that are doing it in the streets or lower level. That's right. where they get the inspiration. Sure, like, oh, of course. Is, well, no, uh, that's what I mean. where it all I, comes from. But, yeah. like, you can't be Madonna and then be, like, with your ear on the street. You got to have, like, three Someone teams down there that are yeah. like, yeah, I'm down on the For street. Sure. Yeah. I see them wearing lace yeah. and they cut off yeah. gloves. Uh, that's what's going on yeah. down here. I saw this fucking group with five people performing, but there was nobody there. But their fucking look was insane. Their right. sound was crazy. You should hey, take it. Hey, yeah. Tito. Sure. Hey, Tito. Yeah. Go down there, down yeah. to the street and tell yeah. me what's going on. I see yeah. motherfuckers down here dancing, but they, they're dancing by walking backwards. What? What the fuck is that? <laughs> I think they're calling it the moonwalk. Yeah, that's real funny. <laughs> that's great, bro. All right. That's great, bro. They like Calm it. Down. They uh, like it. Calm down. I mean, partner. what the fuck? We're going to soap them up for the next 30 minutes. But gonna... that, that, that's a real story, though, right? not going to take the moonwalk but away from Michael Jackson. Someone else I'm made not... it, supposedly, though, right? Yeah, that is true. Yeah. Yeah. Remember like, Till yeah. Tony shows a documentary about the B-boy that created oh, the moonwalk? What was that dude's name? I forgot, but I've I seen a documentary of a whole about that. There's yeah. not only that. There, um, Fosse. But Mike's the king. There's Bob a, Fosse. Bob Fosse also uh, influenced Michael heavily, and there's a movie where he's dancing with a midget or mm. something, and he's mm. like the Snake King. And if mm. you look at all of Bob Fosse's moves, all that jazz. It's not all that jazz, but it is yeah. the guy from all yeah. that jazz, right? Yeah. And he's dancing in the desert, and there's like a like a kid in it. And it's weird, but yeah. when you watch it. It's all of Michael's moves. Now, mm. Michael does do it better than Bob Fosse. Like, mm -hmm. when you watch it, you go, oh, shit, that's where Michael got that. But then you also go, like, well, but he was a, he, right, he right, was right, way right. snappier than Bob Yeah, man. he's the GOAT. Turbo. Right? He's the GOAT. Turbo oh, what was his name, name, huh? Yeah, what's his yeah. name, Turbo? The B-Boy or something. Some break dancer from New York. Supposedly invented What What do you guys, I, I know that, like, so are you, are you current, like, <laughs> Is the deal that you're in like we're, fuck that deal? We're independent. Okay, you guys, yeah, I wanted to. I know you guys were working hard to like finish that maybe business up uh, or something like that. I mean, shit, we try to you know reach out, but nobody has a conversation with us, so mm, it is yeah. what it is. You know, what's understood don't got to be explained. Yeah, fuck that deal. Yeah. So as far as we're concerned, is <laughs> we're independent. Like we. We did our 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 side as far as like being uh pretty transparent on what we want as far as the exit um offered you know to buy us out um and whatever we 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 proceed like we know like you know it's got to make sense for everybody and for us what makes sense for us is to do what we got to do because we got families to feed and we can't just sit here and rot, you know what I'm saying? So man, you got we're outfits independent. to buy and uh, shit. Yeah, outfits outfits to to buy, buy. For sure. videos yeah. to shoot. Yeah, right. right. Oh. You know what? That should be the name so of your next album is Fuck That Deal. We got Tigers to buy. <laughs> right. Yeah, so when people still associate us with the deal, it's like there is no deal. Like, there is nothing, bro. It's you heard us. that yeah. on the Hard Luck Show. You hear that? Yeah. There is so no deal. Let's keep it moving. Yeah. yeah. It's, hey. it's, it's, it's everything people see us do is just us. There, We used to have one or two people help us out. 
That that's not even the, no, the case no that longer. Ain't even Dude, it's just us. Being We're not listening to nobody yeah. no more. Cause yeah. don't nobody knows shit. <laughs> yeah. We don't know shit half the time. Exactly. I but love that. I'm just trying to figure out how I'm gonna help these guys I, to get to where they're going. What do you mean? Like, if I'm gonna be able I to help. Lo- I yeah, love please do, guys. man. You've already helped us, man. You've helped yeah, us. Yeah, I but fucking, a lot for sure. I love a dude, nurse and it might be because I'm a hard headed motherfucker, but when a guy goes, I ain't listening to nobody no more. I ain't even listening to myself no more. That's <laughs> all. Fuck that. Nobody Man. knows shit. That's the, truth, that's the truth. truth. When you when you figure out that that's, that's the, the truth, truth to enlightenment, that you don't know nothing. Yeah. So trying to figure it out, you hold yourself back because it's like <laughs> shit. Go. Just, just go. Just go. And man. at the end of the Head day, down, Big go. Pick Mike just agreed with you. Yeah. <laughs> he's back there and he's like, "That's right. I almost lost my <laughs> foot." And what they're saying is true. Yeah. On some spiritual native shit, like yeah, nothing come on. really matters anyways. Like if. A, yeah. So when you start thinking too much, all oh, this felt, I'm embarrassed or whatever. He's like, guess what, bro? In a in a hundred years, if you're lucky, it doesn't matter. So who cares? If you're uh, lucky, nothing matters. <laughs> in a hundred like, years, it, you're gonna be it, dead it, as it, dead, it, motherfucker. It, and you it, ain't uh, gonna know shit. In well, if you lived hundred, years, might as well do it because it don't matter. Dude, if you live to hundred, there's at least ten years where you're just glad you could take a shit. You don't yeah. care about none of that other Man, stuff. You're like ninety to. T- I've seen some pretty healthy old people. Yeah, I know some healthy old yeah, people. Yeah, but at ninety, they probably got rashes. Yeah. Oh, they do. My my wife, eczema. My wife's grandma's fucking. She takes care of herself. And she's 97. She lives by herself, takes care of herself, showers yeah, herself, but wipes her ass herself. Man. Pretty. How healthy. do you know that? How do you? Because well, I go there pretty frequently. <laughs> <laughs> All right, uh, I stand corrected. You probably corrected. get bruised by just going to bed and laying down on your bed. Right. You, like, make a jelly bruised. sandwich and you got, like, a broken yeah. hand. She do got random bruises 24-7. But, yeah, when you get that uh, old, you don't even ask about it. Yeah, you just no, see, like, no, blue no. shit happening on people and you're like, I don't know, they're 97. Yeah. What am I going to do? They're still living and she's still yeah. wiping her ass. So God bless her. Yeah. yeah sure. How do you That's guys it. how do you guys shop for clothes? Cuz you guys always look cool, you got look <laughs> interesting, but I'm um, kind of curious as how you make the decisions and shit. My boy Luck right here. <laughs> <laughs> oh yeah. Go yeah. Get some. Yeah. yeah. Keeps Cookies. me laced. Yeah. Sure. Yeah. Definitely uh, sending a big uh, box yeah. out for Christmas. Uh, yeah. Right. Yeah, for sure. I was just having this conversation with one of the homies. I was like, "Our our 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 niche is like finding stuff that isn't expensive and making it look fly. Like this is just a Dickies jacket. But, you know what I'm saying? With so it's like if you got style, much, you can make you know? anything. But look But that's fly. the truth. That's the truth of it, though, bro. Yeah, that yeah. is the truth, really. Yeah. Like so many motherfuckers are caught up on the label, the label. Like, but if you really got it, you can bust out. Man, I'll bust out some motherfucking red liners and some motherfucking right. Like that shit man, everybody cool. will be wanting to go get that 100%. shit. These right. motherfuckers you know be mean? out here make looking it. like mannequins and yeah. shit. Right, like, dog. You can make you can <laughs> make shit look looking cool. Looking like a fucking purse. Yeah, people be even though we do, purse. purse. Even though sometimes we do like the high end shit, right? But it's not like. Nine times out of ten, but we bro. don't do it like a mannequin. It's just like nah, nah. Even just because you got you Gucci on, don't mean little, it's fresh. You know what I'm saying? You gotta right. throw your own little yeah, twist but, yeah. to it. Yeah, but, yeah, man, it's all about like a, a bunch of motherfuckers could wear that fucking corduroy hat. Wouldn't look cool. No, but the thing is, built for him. Let's see, put it on this fool. Right? Yeah, put it on. The thing of it is, though, dude. Let me tell you. I don't want lice. I got damage, but I got loud. Don't worry about it. But the thing is, is like. He ain't just wearing a hat though. Like, like you, you purposely were like, nah, I'm gonna leave this fucking straight. It's just falling like this. Yeah. And, and your talent, <laughs> and, 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 it. and that yeah. hat almost Shit. says to me like, man, fuck you. Like, I don't <laughs> give a fuck, right? True. I mean, it's just like it's my personality. Like, I'm just a conscious asshole. Right, but also funny. Like yeah. you, you don't mean it totally, totally, literally. No, nah, I do. Busting chop. Oh, you do. <laughs> yeah. Oh well, then I take offense. My <laughs> How dare you? Nah, nah, yeah. yeah. For sure, yeah. yeah. I just well, I think it looks cool. I I like that shit. And I think I've had yeah. this jacket since I was a fucking senior in Dude, high school. Do you look like you go to University of Washington? <laughs> I didn't go to. You want to know what? It, 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 like it also it also uh, loans itself to you guys' bride broad vision on on yeah, who you yeah. are. Right. For you're sure. not. You're not. I don't. So you're not wearing fucking. Blue and gray all the time, bro, and nothing else. Cause right. You know what I'm yeah. saying? Like, right. They're not afraid to express, you know, try different cool shit. It's just more about who they are and what they do. I, I can't put a finger on you guys. That's why I watched it. I don't know what's going to come out. You yeah. know what I'm saying? I'm, we don't know if that's a good thing or a bad thing. That's a good thing, bro. <laughs> yeah. I, I watch it because it's always something yeah. fresh, and I look forward to well, like. Well, people watch or they gravitate towards stuff that's different. I mean, dude. 
<clears throat> my buddy Dan. They also gravitate to what's good. Yeah, exactly. Well, I mean, some people do. Some people gravitate. One of the homies to today, what did he say? He was like, man, what if you keep shooting and you keep fed? Because we're like, whoa, our formula is just shoot, shoot. He's like, what if you shoot forever and you miss? And it's like, damn, it's probably because. It sucks, like, cause it does. Work? It no, also, no, if no. you suck, it's gonna be harder if you shoot a lot. No, right? no, 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 no. I'm gonna so, say no. If you play against Kobe Bryant, go ahead. All right, let's talk about before an or after the helicopter. <laughs> <laughs> that's fucked up. Is that too soon? Sorry, yeah, that's, that's fucked up. That's, that's the Indian. Only the Indian. I'm gonna pretend it. I didn't hear that. Yeah, right. <laughs> it wasn't. It wasn't that bad until you laughed, though. Yeah, <laughs> that's true. He did <laughs> laugh. But because it was funny, it was just too. Everybody laughed. I love fucking Kobe. Little fucked up. I love Kobe too. All right, go ahead, please. I'm just saying, like, Kobe. no matter how much you shoot, you ain't gonna do what Kobe did. You know what I'm saying? So well, 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 well. I don't know because remember, Kobe sucked at the beginning. When Kobe first started out, he tells it openly. No, He's like, the, I, the, my yeah. hand wasn't that big. I had to get yeah, stronger. He practiced a lot. Not only practice, I mean, practiced a lot. He practiced more than NBA motherfuckers. Yeah, he lived it. He, that was his life. Dude, he some people, he lost a game in Florida. Right? Yeah, I don't know. Oh, listen, I'm telling you. Mm. He lost a game in Florida. <laughs> okay. And, and he's the top of whatever, right? He missed one shot. Everyone else on the team and the opposing team, everybody went to fucking hot nights, Miami Beach, mm -hmm. and partied. Kobe Bryant stayed at the stadium and practiced the shot that he missed for hours on end. And that this was when, when he airballed? Yeah, was and this airballed? is when he was the top of the top still. That's the kind, he was like Michael Jordan. Like he took. I agree. 100%. Less, so, so, my point when you say, however many shots you take, you might suck, blah, blah. blah. I'm saying. On one hand, yeah, you, you do have a point. That is true. But at the same time, if you're practicing you're that better. much, yeah. you are going to get better. Yeah. And also, never forget. And no or change the formula. If you can't dunk, that, that's why I was, I was leaning to that. Right, go ahead. Out. So I was like, no matter, because you're not six feet six, right? So your what? approach is going to be different than Kobe's approach. Sure. So it's like Kobe is like, all right, if you're shooting, 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 and missing, missing, missing for years on end, Maybe you gotta change your approach. That's what I'm saying. Like, no, that's you could 100. suck. You could suck at this. Maybe what you're choosing, you suck at it. Mm -hmm. Find what you don't suck as much at, and try to get better. So, at that. so you gotta be also able to self-assess and know where exactly. you're at. Yeah, you're 100 exactly. on yeah, that. Which we've done all this year. We've, we've been a lot of self-assessment, like what's working, what's not working, what looks like we're trying too much versus what's just completely natural. So I think we finally found the, like the. When we decided, fuck all these opinions, we're going to do what we want. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, I agree with that. That's yeah, the that hard. Ultimately that comes down it. to that. Like, fuck, we're listening to everybody That's and it. they're wrong. And I and guess we're kind of right. Be we your wrong. fucking self. And yeah, yeah, bro. That, you can't bro, go wrong with that. That right there is the one. Like, That's can't nobody be true. you but you. It sounds cliche as fuck, but yeah. it's the truth. Can't nobody be you but you. And that's what you're going to bring to the table that's different. And yeah. what, what I'm saying is, is like, in today's world, I think it's even hard. Uh, like, like as cliche as it is, it's actually hard to be the real you. Yeah. yeah. Right? Yeah, it's, like, it actually hard. It, it comes with vulnerability. Yep. Yeah. And yep. a right. lot of people aren't willing to do that. Right. But, you know, it's some, as artists, you got to kind of accept it. And the more you open up, you'll see that more people more people relate to you than you know you know yeah. I, mean? I see it as a definite strength like yeah, i said yeah. you know before i see all of it as like somebody who's confident in who they are yeah. uh who understands you know what, what who, where they come from and are okay with who they are mm -hmm. you know that's how i see it that, right, that's yeah. what i think maybe why it grabs me or resonates with me right because i'm so used to like the static that ain't yeah. doing none of that for, for me. sure. Right. So All I the rah rah. Right, man. When I see somebody actually, you know, uh, Let you know their comes off his confidence. Yeah, yeah. bro. Like and him, he's always talking about, oh, I'm fat, I'm fat. Uh, no, and he went viral. <laughs> 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 well, there's a lot of fat people out there. They can relate. But, exactly. They can relate to you. I never, I never rapped about that. <laughs> no, nah, um, but I will. I probably should. <laughs> Uh, shit, that shit, my weight loss journey, shit. It works for uh, DJ Khaled. That hold motherfucker's on, fat all over the internet. Say that guy's name. You gotta I know, but he's back. fat all over podcast. the internet. Yeah, you got to talk about your love for tacos. <laughs> Joel, what? Who is this? My, it was my boy. He's on a bumper car. Yeah. What's up? Ladies and gentlemen. Whatever. Nah, he don't like none of that shit. 
Man, uh, I don't know, like bro. Get like whatever, shit. dog. Some some cool shit. Um, <laughs> right, get some cool shit. That's but, the way to do it. Yeah. Get some cool shit. Bye. <laughs> That's how you good rise to handle that shit. Don't call me back. <laughs> yeah, right, I'm, but, I, dude. I can't be helping you with every fucking decision. Like real. fucking, let's go. It's like fucking boy, bro. Think of what a little boy wants. Uh, yeah. Right, your, your boy. You my know. my kid is eight, going on fucking twenty one. Yeah. You don't play with no toys. He don't want to What does that mean? Wait, 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 wait. What do you say, <laughs> man? Like, he's super he's, mature? He thinks he's grown. He wants to be one of <laughs> us. He wants to be in the videos. He gets oh, mad shit. when he can't come. He yeah. fucking wants to be next to the bitches shaking their ass. Well, I, oh, that. I know, that makes that. sense he to want, me. He wanted uh, um, one of those, uh, you know, those guns that throw the single dollar bills. Yeah. Hey, I want that for Christmas because he wants to yeah, make hey, it you, rain. What do you need that for, yeah. man? Hey, another, I want one of them too. Right. Yeah, another yeah, one yeah. We all want that. Let's put yeah. that on the list. Cookie should make one of those too. We hey. Yeah, we That'd got cool. one. Yeah. But hey, I, lo- that, I love that. Give me that, that phone, doggy. Give me that little phone. Oh, that little that's old it. fucking busted yeah. up motherfucker. <laughs> <laughs> hey, man, I love the fact that, uh, like, you're a dad and your son's eight years old. What kind yeah. of what kind of advice would you give other fathers that are they're listening right now? Um, they're driving their car. They're saying, I want to be a good dad. Like, Yote. Like, Fuck I- them kids. Is that what it is? <laughs> nah. Nah, right. Nah, I'll say uh, <laughs> uh, don't force anything on your kids. Let them make their own decisions for themselves. If you're a fucking used to be basketball player, don't fucking force that down your son's throat. Let right. him decide what the fuck he wants to do. Right. Just because you're a failure, you're trying to relive your dreams <laughs> to your son. Let him find out his own dreams, man. Yeah. Right. And then once they do, then yeah. you, you encourage and you, encourage you, you water that. You right. So, like, when they're like, listen, dad, I want to be by some big booty bitches and I want a gun that shoots fucking hundreds. Right, you hey, got to water that, right? Yeah, got to water it. <laughs> yeah. I'm, trying to look for, I'm trying to look for one. Uh, I'll buy it for, him for Christmas. I but, love that, man. Yeah. No, and you know what, man? Going back to art, I know it sucks to hear this, but it is also true. It is also true. Sometimes you're so far ahead that you'll yeah. die. Before the success finally comes, Van Gogh. I'm that not Van die. Gogh. That was was one of my aliases. My name was Victor Van Gogh. That's I, real. I hope I didn't I didn't self prophesize that. It doesn't matter on a certain level because, I mean, it matters from a pop, pocketbook standpoint and all that shit. Yeah. I get it, bro. B- believe me, if there's anybody that understands this fucking thing, I do. Right. Mm, yeah. I'm, like, I'm definitely trying to feed my family off this shit. Right. Yeah. yeah. But, You're going to. You're gonna feed yeah. a lot of people. But sure. but. When it comes to art, though, you might... Dude, I don't think people really think about this, but, you know, the the generation that you're born into and that you're putting whatever it is out to, a lot of those folks are inundated with teachings and whatever else that makes it hard for them to recognize, like, oh, wait a second. Mm. These guys are actually shining a light on something that really matters. And so for Mm. this generation now, right, you got to really think about this. They might not understand what Mm. you're getting at, but there may come a time when people will be like, holy fuck. Mm -hmm. Like, we were too stupid. Yeah, that's going to happen for mm -hmm. sure. Within Within the next year. I would say that's happened to so many artists yeah. in history. For sure. for sure, yeah. When they're just kind of ahead of their time. Yep. You kind of have to be as an artist. Have to be. I mean, if you're not ahead of your time as an artist, then you're essentially just like, like a skilled craftsman for like some company, yeah. right? Like you're just, I'm gonna make the next Coke commercial. Uh, it's yeah. the real one. It's yeah. real. You know? No, no, no. That's that's <clears throat> where you're at if you're not ahead of your time. If you're not really looking at things and, and seeing stuff yeah. and trying things and inventing things. There's so many stories in fashion, Big Lux, For sure. right? Mm-hmm. Where people, they were ahead of their time. And uh, fuck, I read this whole fucking book on Coco Chanel. Mm. Okay. Oh, I, I, I heard a lot about her recently. Man. And I'm telling you right now, man, It's almost like people don't trust you as an artist if they don't think there was a period of time Mm -hmm. where you were ahead of your time or people couldn't see what you were doing. Because if there's another thing that people love in this goddamn country is discovering an artist. Oh, for sure. Mm -hmm. Or people that do know that that I told you so, like, they they love that. Like, and I respect those people because there's a lot of people like that I feel on our side now 
that yeah. can't wait to tell people I told y'all. And I knew I, and, them before they blew up. Right. And to me, they it's try like to claim you. Yeah, I don't. You know, like it's a big <laughs> responsibility. I feel bad for people to be like, man, I've been rocking with y'all since they'll say like CNC Squad. Yeah, we done let y'all down I'm multiple like, times. Man, I've been man, on a journey with <laughs> us, boy. Like, fuck. yeah, but yeah. you know what, man? Those those people, right? I appreciate those people. I do too. Yeah. But those people are going to translate into exponential growth. Mm -hmm. Those people, when it when the when it when the sunlight starts to crack just a little bit, are gonna feel themselves validated. For sure. And they're gonna push. And if there's one thing, dude, I don't know. I saw some random shit. Motherfucking It's not like the tipping point. Right. Yeah. And if you have people whose identity or passion is 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 with you guys and then the, and then up, there's dog. like some light that's getting shined they will actively and passionately push your shit uh, and that's scaling Hello, up nice to meet you finally dog <laughs> that's scaling up ladies and gentlemen uh mr and mrs earbuds if you, if you must know <laughs> we have the one the only conejo rapper here he's yeah. breaking oh, a little oh, bit of bread with yote uh, yes, over here sir. we got the Yoze. With prime god with Prime <laughs> and everything. Yeah. So uh, this is a massive, 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 uh, I want to say, uh, meeting of talent. For sure. Right oh, now. Yeah. Right? LA's in For the house. Sure, sure. LA is in the house. We're rocking the show the ninth with Conejo, too. Are yeah. you? Yeah. 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 See that? Yeah, That's sure. what we're talking about, yeah. man. Yeah. <laughs> Good to see you. Oh, yeah. yeah. But yeah, man. There's, the, I think the law of the universe is there is a tipping point as long as you keep adding bricks to it. It's got to tip over eventually. Yeah. Um. So yeah, that's what that's what we're trying to do, man. Just keep adding to the snowball. Right, and the yeah. speedball. And the oh, speedball. I, you know, man, it, it's uh, and the eight ball. Uh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> it's um, it's uh. You know, again, bro, I'm just going to say that when you're on something, either that's what you do, either that's you or it's not. You right. Know? It yeah. either is or it isn't, man. It's like, it may, yeah. and it may look crazy from the outside and, and the, the distance, the line in between, you know, when they show to the, from here to there and it's a scribbly motherfucker. Right. Line. That's just how it goes, man. Oh, for sure. 100%. You know, um, 100%. and it, it's all part of the story. And I think that as you, I mean, that's what I love about biographies and reading stories hell right. yeah when i go look at all the people that i admire I look at, there was times where the shit was bleak bro yeah. frank it, it sinatra like, 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 up. Like, you're like, like damn these motherfuckers just stayed showing up that's the yeah. one thing they didn't do just give up all of them was they just didn't give up sinatra yeah. Yeah. hell yeah sinatra right, right? yeah uh, i love watching sinatra biographies said. for that reason like when i feel like uninspired and i'll watch it from every type of thing like Wrestling yeah. biographies, music biographies, right. act, like just like the 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 fucking willpower it takes to just stick to your guns, even when it's like you got nothing left but your fucking vision, your balls and yeah. your words. Yeah, it's like it's stressful. It's, I wouldn't I wouldn't advise this journey on nobody because you have to be super thick skinned and like uh, be pretty much open to criticism from the whole fucking world. Sure. And it's yeah. tough to take mm -hmm. sometimes, yeah. Yeah. Well, so December 9th, what's happening? We got a show with the homie Conejo. He's headlining shit. Um, we're going to perform a good portion of our new album that just dropped. Yeah. Uh, so it's going to be cracking, man. It's going to be lit. Give, be lit, give right. everybody the name of the new album, where they go to find it. Let's get that real clear for our listeners right now. Uh, it's called Thicker Than Water. It's a mixtape, EP, whatever the fuck you want to call it. Um, it's, on, <laughs> it's on iTunes right now. Yep. This motherfucker fucked up the drop. I did. <laughs> yeah. He all just off Hell of the title. Yeah. So Spotify ain't off. posted today. Yet, yeah. But they'll have it up there next week. Yeah, so for sure. It should be on Spotify by December 9th. Yeah. Um. <laughs> Nah, yeah. it'll be there before then. It should be there before the end of the year. Hopefully, hopefully Monday it's there. Um, and we'll keep you updated. I was fucking stressed out last night, but uh, yeah. But it's yeah, dude, man, you need to make shit. a video with this dude stressed out. That would be interesting. Right? Watch you be like, uh, no one no, this punching. part of this part of like the pro, pro, part of the sometimes like, the story. He, one yeah. day he's gonna be like, remember when you fucked that fucking drop mm -hmm. up? And right? Because it's just you guys doing it. Yeah, right? Exactly. right? We have that shit go on over here, don't we? 
Uh, you know? Right? Oh, blue oh eyes. yeah, right? Both blue eyes. Oh, blue eyes, huh? Yeah. Ups and downs. Oh, I didn't oh. record this whole uh, fucking two hour show. Uh, I fucked that's that. Happened. Ah. That happened before? Hell yeah. Oh, yeah, dude. We won't get in that. There, that happened to us, too. We did a whole interview with someone. He's like, damn, bro, I didn't record yeah, none of that's it. That's fucking, uh, yeah. We, we had it happen. Let me, let me, let me. We've had shit happen where, like, we have guests all coming down, and yeah. then our engineer forgets that it's the day that we're recording. Yeah, because. And yeah. this when we cancel everything. Yeah. Yeah, we call him and we're like, what's home. going on? And he's like, uh, yeah, tomorrow, right? And we're like, no, we're in the fucking studio, bro. What are you talking yeah, about? Yeah, yeah. Well, my wife made fucking pizza today. Or what? Yeah! Oh, yeah. And also... It's always somebody's wife or something. That's always the scapegoat. <laughs> is, like, that true is that true or blue eyes? Is that your wife messed that up the happened? calendar? No, that's the scapegoat. No. He really didn't no. want to do it. No, no, <laughs> that's it. Is it because the San Francisco 49ers game was on that day and no, he fucked us no. off for that? That's probably the two. He got too drunk and forgot. He oh, had yeah. the goggles on, was in cyberspace, playing some fucking crazy fucking war He game. took himself no. out on a date. It he was, was the hookers and cocaine. Yeah. Was it the hookers and cocaine? I thought I saw you on La Siena get that Momo on La Siena go with hey, Cadillac. Was that you? Like, was it, no, you? I don't want to bring down the show. <laughs> were you at Yum Yum Donuts? Is that what it was? <laughs> uh, Santa Monica. <laughs> I don't know. Well, he was on what, Fig. <laughs> what's that Yum Yum Donuts, man? <laughs> <laughs> Ask Big Lebke. He can tell yeah. you. He'll take you right down there and show you. All right, all right. <laughs> so, well, yeah, man. so. Well, man, so oh, you've but, heard it. What's up? Yeah, thicker Where, than water. Thicker than water, water yep. right? Proud of that shit. Man. Go get that yeah, shit man. ASAP. The Fuck the deal. Fuck, Fuck that deal. deal. Yeah. Hey, and Fuck what people think. Fuck that deal. Right. Yeah. And stick to your fucking guns, man. Yeah. yeah. And uh, where December 9th will this performance be? I forgot the name of the place. You remember it? Don something? It's called Don Quixote. Don Quixote. The address is 2811 East Olympic Boulevard. 2811. East Olympic. East Olympic Boulevard. Yeah, Don right. Quixote. It's going to be lit, man. It's going to be super lit. December yeah, it's 9th. Gonna be, do it's not gonna go, be entertaining. Do not go there if you're a square or if you're scared. This is for real shit. This is We're gonna be mosh the big, pitting. You're yeah. mosh pitting. I'm going. Let's go. You've got to be the mosh pit ringleader, though. Who? You. Yeah, sure. Wow. Okay. Yeah, wear your tennis it's shoes. A lot of that, pressure. Right? Tennis shoes. I'm gonna come in there in a suit of armor, brother. You gotta do your. Armor. You gotta do your native screech too. Oh, that. I'll do that. Yeah. yeah. Are yeah. you Are you kidding me? I'll go there with no shirt on. I'll oh, go yeah. crazy. Shit, I'll fucking Let's do it. Fucking paint jump hard off luck show all over your body. H L S and yeah, red. Yeah, 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 I'll put a yeah, knife yeah, in my teeth. The yeah, whole yeah, thing. You'll yeah, love it. You'll love it. Don't say it and don't do it. Hey. We're gonna be like, y'all ready to mosh pit? And then I'm gonna look for you. Yeah. I'm gonna be right there pushing old blue eyes right in front of me. Red hot. <laughs> Alright, look at right, Ovanda cool. Bowen LLP. We were braids to court. Let the Tomahawks fly the best legal representation that money can buy. Hmm. You got anything there, big guy? Shout out Mike Angelo Photography. That's it, man. Fuck, Mike know. Angelo Photography. King Mike Salmon, Angel you got anything? King Salmon, this guy. Get in there. Get in there. Where are you? Dragon Hello, Balls. Dragon Balls. Dragonbags.com with a Z. Get to 21 <laughs> faster. <laughs> Get to 21 faster. Yeah, dude. You should let him shoot your Sean. Next video. www.hardluckshow.com Right. Yes, sir. It's no gum road shit. No gum road. HLS.gumroad.com. Sean, yeah. Sean at movemental.media. Nah. What? <laughs> oh, man. That is not so. Whoa. Okay, so. Oh, uh, <laughs> www.supermaxhardware.com. Come to peep us out. Uh, get some stuff for the holidays. Cookies SF. And vibespapers.com. <laughs> Check us out. We'll get some. Um, a shout out to Estevan Oriel and the Soul Assassin. Shout out to Burner and the Cookies ooh, family, ooh, Vibes ooh, family. Ooh, ooh, ooh. And uh, a big shout out to one of our number one sponsors, Enzo's Pizzeria. Appreciate yeah, you, Enzo. Cal by zone. the way, Smoke Vibes. <clears throat> Smoke vibes. What is that? Is there weed in there or not? Uh, no, you got to put the weed in there, but these are fucking fat ass fucking. High. Yeah, get in there. I got some for you, Conejo. So uh, we are, yep, 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 and we're ready to go. We're out of yeah. here. Hasta yeah, la vista, out. Coyote for hire, you guys. Ooh, yes, Adios. Sir. Oh, sir. This one is my boss. I don't understand. I don't understand. I don't understand. I don't understand. Uh, uh, I'm from Humberside. Love big dick.